going on, dude? How are you doing? How are you doing? You alright, yeah? yeah? Nice to see you again. Oh, how have you been? You've been alright, yeah? Yeah, uh, it's been a bit cold, the weather's changed. Pardon? The weather's changed. Or is it getting colder? Yeah. I've got this jacket I put on when I'm yeah. in my sleeping bag, it's really warm. You put on when you're in the sleeping bag, keep you warm. Putting it in at the moment, it's a bit wet. Sure, is there any chance I'm going to ask you a question? Of course. Try it away. Is why you're homeless? Why? I was um, evicted from my home. I lived there nine years on Church Street. On yeah. Edgar, and um, at one point, a few months prior to this, I just split up with my girlfriend. You just split up with your girlfriend? She'd come back to live in France. We had a daughter. Born so you so with you have a daughter? With her, with her, yeah. Do you get to see your daughter at all? No, no. I've got another one that's a lecturer. Oh, you've got Nothing. another. You got another child. Well, and, and a son. <laughs> and a son. And, I've got one son. Oh, you have got and one son. Three daughters. One son, three daughters. Yeah. So you got four kids. Yeah. If, it, if you know, what I mean, if I can help out in any way possible to help you get contact with your kids, I will. Is that something you would want to do? Yeah. Yeah. Is that something you really want to do? Daughter in Nazi. What's her, what's her name? Hannah. Hannah, her name's Hannah. Well, I could try my best, you, and try and, you know what I mean, get in contact somehow. If that's something you want, I can try and help out somehow. Yeah? Hey guys, so, I was meant to be doing a video asking people stories of why they're homeless. And I know this guy who I was just talking to, and I've helped him out quite a few times, and I really do sympathise for him because he's honest, he's genuine, and he has a, he has a f quite a few daughters and a son out there. But he has a daughter in Nottingham, he says. So I'm going to offer it to go get his air car, give him somewhere to stay tonight, and in the meantime, if you guys can share this video to find out who his daughter is, that was amazing. I love you all. Let's go. What's going on, Shu? This is my this is my friend that he's gonna be documenting it. Is that okay? Yeah. Um, what we was doing though, we was going around and asking people that are homeless why they're homeless to try and get an understanding of why. But I like you, and I've helped you out a few times, and you're sincere, and you've got a real genuine personality about it. And I want to take you to get your hair cut, get your beard trimmed, give you somewhere to stay tonight. How's that sound? Sounds great. Sounds great, yeah. Come grab your stuff and let's go. Okay. Let's roll. I'm nervous. You're nervous? When was the last time you um, had the beard trim and the haircut? Three months ago. Oh, three months ago you last had it cut. We need to get a quick before and after. You ready? Yeah. So, look at the camera. What's your daughter's full name? Anna. Durkin. D U R K I N. See if we can try and find, find her on Facebook. It's not there, is it? Mm. No. Hannah and Natalie Durkin? No. No. Uh, Hannah Durkin, a postdoctoral researcher at the University of Nottingham. Does that sound like her? That's, that's her. Is this, is this her? Yeah. That's her. We found her, guys. We found her. That's her. So that, are you sure? 100% yeah? Okay, I'm going to try and um, find out a profile for you. What do you think of the haircut? Hi. Nice. nice, yeah? Oh, looking good. Come on, we need to get a selfie. Thank you very much, man. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you very much, man. How much does that do? That's fine. You sure? Yeah, perfect. Thank you very much, man. I appreciate it. See you later. Have a good day. See you later, yeah, everyone, man. Bye bye. Um, do you want to get somewhere sorted so you can stay tonight? I don't feel. I don't know. Not, not staying indoors. You sure? It's like, yeah. The expense and everything like that. I don't mind doing it, mate. Honestly, I'll give you somewhere to stay in. Well, this is something, anyway. Are you sure? I wish I'd be beard cut, man. <laughs> man. You look good as well, dude. I promise, I promise you. You look really, actually, you look really, really good. But I promise you, as soon as you, if your daughter replies back to me on email, then. 100% I'll find you straight away tomorrow and I'll come and let you know yeah, with him. I sit on that stuff most Yeah, yeah, I know. You know I'm still getting over it. Like, hello, hello. <laughs> haircut. What? <laughs> well, can I have a fucking haircut in my beard chair? <laughs> it's a bit too much. It's a bit too much? Yeah. Never too much, man. That's why I wanted to get you something to stay as well, dude. And 
You know what I mean? That's fine. I'm going to get a I need a new pair of pants. You need a new pair of trousers? You need a new pair of trousers? Go get you some new trousers and... Yeah, man, I, I think I might have a few other things I can hook you up with as well, so I'll see what... Hey, lovely. Hey, I've got you stuff. Here's your coffee. Oh, lovely. Is there sugar in it? Yeah, 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 sugar in it. I've got you a few t-shirts and some trousers and some fresh socks as well. Yes. So I've got you all that lovely, stuff. Lovely. And I've got you a sandwich as well. I know you said you wasn't. Tickle, wiggle, wiggle. <laughs> tickle, wiggle. <laughs> it's the only ones I've got in my car. What's all that about? I just do, I've done the video tickling people's beards and they're the only ones literally I've got left in my car, so. Tickle, wiggle, wiggle. Yeah, tickle, wiggle, wiggle. <laughs> i got you a sandwich as well. I know you said oh, you wasn't that hungry, but I thought we'd get you a sandwich as well. Yeah. But um, I'll be back tomorrow and um, I'll let you know if your daughter replies yeah, back to me cool. and then I'll come back and I'll let you know so as soon as possible. So what you do, you go onto her email page? Yeah, 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 I emailed her. Um, I just emailed her, I said, um, hello, it's Jack, um, I found your dad and it'll be nice if you can speak to him and he can speak to you and, and then go from there pretty much. That's what my mum says. <laughs> that's what my mum says, so that's I'm I'm pretty well. much mm -hmm. literally done as much as I can. That's fantastic. Right? That's all I, I try doing you know, I mean, best as I can to try and help you mate. That's all I can do and I'm going to love you and leave you. Yeah, no, you. See you tomorrow, yeah? yeah, you be good all right. Yeah, Are you sure you don't want me to pay for someone for you to stay tonight? No, seriously. Are you sure, yeah? Yeah. He, I'll look after John and Tom. Yeah. All right, and he said the barber, said, the barber said if you can go, if you want to go back there for air car, then you're more than welcome to. Yeah. Okay? The same barber? Yeah, same barbers, okay? Right. Lovely. See you soon, Stuart. Keep your chin up, all right, bro. Thanks a lot. God bless. I'll see you tomorrow, okay? See you soon, mate. Bye bye.